Shalom and good morning, everybody. How Class are you doing today? Session. Such wonderful news. I just can't wait to share it with you. What is it, Jacob? Please tell me <laughs> okay. what it is. Well, Jesus is alive. What? But Jacob, yeah. he was dead. I, I know, but... I, I was still crushed. But, but oh God goodness. raised him from the dead, just, just like Jesus was saying all along. Oh. He's alive, Jacob. He's alive, Rachel. It's He's alive. Jesus is alive. Look, I'll tell you all about it, but first, I think we ought to just sing a really, really happy song to celebrate that Jesus is alive. So come on up. Come on up. I want everybody to come up today. Everybody. You don't have a choice. You have to come up. Weston, you got to come up today. There you go. Good job. Girls, come up. Everybody has to come up today so we get used to everybody being up here. Hi, Colton. We're glad to have you up here, boys. Okay. So, everybody, I don't know what song we're doing right now. Oh. Oh, this is. Oh, this is a new song. Okay, this is a new song. Watch the screen. Okay. Can you turn it up? Death is beaten. You have rescued me. Sing it out. Jesus is alive. I'm going to stand in front. Empty cross, the empty grave Life eternal, you have won the day Shout it out, Jesus is alive He's alive And oh, happy day, happy day You washed my sin away Oh, happy day, happy day I'll never be the same History. Death is beaten, you have rescued me Sing it out, Jesus is alive Empty cross, the empty grave Life eternal, you have won the day Shout it out, Jesus is alive Put your hands up, he's alive Day. You wash my sin away. Oh, happy day, happy day. I'll never be the same. Never be the same. Forever I'm the Forever I'm changed. It's a new heart. And oh, what a glorious day. What a glorious way. Well, you don't, you don't show it. Okay, you want a picture with me? Okay, she wants a quick picture with me. <laughs> Will you take one really quick? Here. Okay, you go on. I, oh, okay, sorry. Okay, Everly. <laughs> Is it okay, Zini's in it? There we go. Okay, thank gotcha. you. Okay, I'll send it to your mom. Oh, that was a perfect song, wasn't it? Perfect song for Rachel to pick out for us. And, and today, if anybody wants pictures with us after the program, please come and get them with yeah. us. We love it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't know. 
Oh man, well we'll ask around. We'll put them on Lammy, and if somebody knows that they are uh, somebody else's, All right, there. there we go. Okay. Okay. All right, and we we have excited babies. Okay, Jake, tell us what's happening. This is truly incredible. It's too good to be true. I, I know. I'm still trying to wrap my head around it. But early this morning, uh, we found out that Jesus is alive. And, and you remember yesterday and all this week, we have been saying, trust, trust Jesus. Jesus. Oh, man, we said it a whole bunch. Look at all the different... All the different ways we've said it. And we're going to do it again more and more today. Jesus promised that death would not be able to hold him. So even though he was dead, he's now alive. And that's, that's, what, that's exactly what happened. So let, let me just start from the beginning. It was very early this morning. The sun Sorry had not that. come up yet. Welcome to my house. Do you know how, <laughs> how it is in the morning just before the sun comes up? And some of the women who, who really helped to take care of Jesus were going to the grave to do some last things that needed to be done. And while they're on the way, just as the sun was starting to come up over the hills, oh there was like goodness. an earthquake. And, and, and I the, felt it. I did too. It woke me up. Oh Lammy was scared. He was oh petrified. No. Well, yeah, that's kind of... Yeah, it's a, a scary, scary thing. Yeah. But the ladies who were there said they were right at the tomb when it happened, and they had a big rock in front of the, the tomb, and it rolled away. And there was just a big flash of light. And when they got to the tomb, they looked in. And you know what they saw? Nothing. Nothing. Except a couple oh, angels. They didn't funny. know they were angels at first. But the angels... Angels were there. Ex I know. I, I, we've never seen anything like this in all of our days. It's, it's, it's amazing. And the angels were telling the ladies that... Why are you looking for Jesus in a graveyard? He's alive. You don't keep, you don't keep live people in a graveyard. Jesus is alive. He's going to meet you. And they were, they really weren't sure what had happened. Oh my they were just so excited, but also what does this mean? And as they were walking along and, and, and heading back to Jerusalem, they saw Jesus. Can you imagine how happy they were? No, I can't. Oh. Just like that song, oh, we'll never be the same forever. Oh, they, I am they ran up to Jesus and they were hugging him. And, and finally, Jesus said, Look, you've got to let me go. I've got stuff for you to do. First of all, I need you to go tell everyone that I'm alive again. And in fact, you know, Rachel, one of the women that saw Jesus this morning. That's it. It was Mary. I do know her, and she's been with him before. She's been seen with him many times. All the time. So, yep, she even, she was one of the ones that were able to touch him, and um, it's just, I, oh. yeah. Does she's, she still see the prints in his hand? She said they were still there. That's but he was, amazing. he was okay. It wasn't, it didn't hurt him. He was like, I'm okay. Even though these, these scars are here, it doesn't hurt anymore. Because Jesus is king. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. Jacob, that's incredible. I think, um, I know that I'm excited, and I bet our tribes are excited too about today. I bet they are. So why don't we take some tribe time right now and share with each other, talk to your, your tribe leader, and just share why this news makes you so happy, okay? And, 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 and knowing that Jesus died for your sins and that he's now alive, he's back from the dead, how that makes you happy. So let's just take a little bit of time and do that with our tribe leaders. We'll see. Can you move over just a little bit, please? Thank you. Would you? Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. Everly, did you, are you okay there? You're okay? Okay. You girls can sit now. Thank you, honey. Thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, very cool. So, what do you think? Does anybody know what's under there? Did, did, okay, keep it a secret. Could be, could be, could be, yeah. All of those things. Huh? Did you did you need a shirt, Colton? Did you get a shirt? Okay. It's okay. 
reminds me of Hudson when I'm talking to him. <laughs> very, very, very detailed. That is very, very cool. Yes. So is everybody got there? Where did Pastor go? Okay. I'm He's right here. Jacob, where did you go? <laughs> Keep calling me Pastor all the time. I know, I'm Who is this Pastor we speak of? I don't know. Must be a great, good looking guy. <laughs> oh, okay. If you look, and I'm young, young. Yes. <laughs> Vibrant. Just like me. Rachel, Ruggedly the handsome. Old song lady. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, goodness. who would like to share? How knowing that Jesus is alive makes you feel. Who would like to do that? Anybody? Raise your hand. Do you want to? Tell me, how does it make you feel? Shout it out. Makes you really good? Good. She said good. To put a smile on your face? There's one way yeah, back right back here. here. Very happy. Very happy. happy. Me too. I mean, I'm just like, whoa. It's what? like that song, Jesus is alive. It's just like explosion of yeah. happiness. Huh? Oh, it's incredible. Do you remember how yesterday we all said, that we could be sad and glad all at the same time. Do you guys remember that yesterday? Because it was sad that Jesus died, but we also were kind of glad because God did it for us. And now we can all be glad because on today, Jesus is back from the dead and God wants us to be completely happy, no sadness, and that we always can trust, trust Jesus. Jesus. Let's do that together. We can always... Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. And look who's here today. He Yay. looks a lot happier too. And my family, I had to be with them yesterday. So I, we all prayed and prayed and never did we expect this. So oh, look at good news. God. Great news. Is awesome. He certainly is. And I am sorry. Lammy was missed. How much did you kids miss Lammy yesterday? Yeah, oh, yes, he maybe he might hide today. He might hide today. He, he feels hide, pretty hoody, playful. Um, yeah, you're so happy he's back. Okay, good. All right. Well, he was and telling he was back, telling uh, both yes. he was telling both Rachel and I how much he missed you guys yesterday. He was he was sorry he wasn't able to be here, but he was just kind of just too sad. And uh, but he's glad to be back today. And we are very happy. And with the good news of Jesus being alive, Lammy wants you guys to stand up and sing a song and a dance for Jesus. So let's so, dance a oh, dance. I don't know which song this is. I would tell you. We'll where. spin the dreidel of songs and <laughs> what will come up? A good one. Song are we They're all have? good, what aren't they? Oh, okay. Everybody oh. needs to stand apart so your arms can reach. We have plenty of room. John Michael, right? Yes. Move all the way down, guys. God Don't be moving down. Okay, we're going to die for us. Let me hear you sing. Because of his great love. I said, I'm going to put you back here so the little people can see. God loves us. God sent his son to die for us. Back by husband. Because of his great love.
I know you guys know it. Good job. And so that's kind of where you'll be when your mom and dads are. So kind of take a note of where you were. Big kids in the back. You did a great job, yeah. girls. Man, that was awesome. They're getting so good at these songs <laughs> good job. today. Good job, guys. So our memory maker for today is memory maker that's our memory friend perhaps memory our memory maker, maker is jesus lives now how easy is that so whenever you hear someone say jesus lives you're going to do what trust, trust jesus. jesus you gotta so that, be listening though all right rachel you you do it for him colton can you scoop just a little bit <laughs> jesus lives I know. trust <laughs> jesus <laughs> So whenever you hear that, do the hand motion okay. and do the shout out. Rachel, uh, why don't you introduce to us our memory friend? A friend is? Well, you know what? What do you think it is? A chick? We're not supposed to say, oh, wait. I'm sorry, A chick? Like a little, like fresh out of the egg chick? Let's see. I... They they think it's they think it's a chick. So let's let's chick 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 chick. Jesus lives. Oh, you guys are so great. Jesus lives. Yes, Jesus. You guys are awesome. I mean, they boy, you can. They nailed that one. And got it, man. Our memory friend is a baby chick who reminds us that new life can be ours through Jesus Christ. This is a new life, a little baby. And every time that we look at this baby chick, it's going to remind us that Jesus lives. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. New life in Christ. You know what, Rachel? That actually ties into our memory verse for today. And um, our memory friend, as we saw, is a baby chick that reminds us that Jesus lives. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. So our memory verse for today is from John 14, 19, and I'm just so happy that I would like to ask you to lead us. Hey, what happened to our memory verse? So our memory verse <laughs> is, because I live, you, you will, will also, also live. live. So what does that mean? What does that mean? Is Jesus alive? Yes. But Jesus died, didn't he? That's very important That's, that we know yep. that he died. But we also, he rose again. He rose and so again. Jesus makes a promise to each of us that someday you will die right, too. That, that makes us sad. But the thing that makes us glad is that like Jesus, guess what? We're going to come back from the dead. And it we'll isn't going to be, it isn't going to be like zombies. No, we will live no. again. We will have like Jesus bodies. They're going to be, be all like oh, Jesus. It's going it's to be great. It's going to be so, And John so David great. said it was three days later that he rose from the that's, dead. And they're that's right on there. Exactly Things right. Things happen fast in Jerusalem Marketplace. It, one day sometimes seems like three, doesn't it? Yes, it does. In, in Jesus' world, there's It sure seemed like Good Friday like yesterday, one. but here we are. It's, yay! Yay, that's awesome. I'm just so happy, Rachel, that I would like to ask you to lead us in two Two great songs. Could we oh do that? Oh my goodness, can you help Max, me? get up here. Please come All and help right. me. Bigger kids in the back. That's you fine. You can stand it. right there. Bigger kids in the back. Bigger kids in the back. You can stand by Huddy and them. Okay? Girls, I want you to let the big kids, um, Edie, down here. You and, and Emmy, right there. You're, you can stand. There you go. No further. Come down one. There you go. Right there. Okay. Let's watch it. We got to look what we're doing. To the Lord, a new song. Turn around again. I want to hear you sing. Sing unto the Lord, a new song. You got this. Sing unto the Lord, all the earth. I want to hear it. Sing unto the Lord, a new song. Sing unto the Lord, all the earth. Sing unto the Lord, all the earth. 
right? Hoy, don't. Yeah, one more. We actually get one more. Come on back. Oops, I'm sorry. I hit you. <laughs> you got it. All right. Okay. Everybody grab where you are. Oh. Okay, stand in the line. I'm going to stand here, guys. Would you do service for Jesus? Stand right side. Weapon this way. Blessing. You guys did so good. I am so proud of you big kids. That is wonderful. I love the big kids singing because when you big kids sing, you make the little kids sing. So thank you. You know, and that's really true. Mm. As, a, as a shepherd, I know that the example I set for the little sheep is really, really important. And especially for you bigger kids, is the littler ones look up to you as well. And so thank you so much. Let's give the big kids a Woo! hand. Yeah, thanks for Yay, being big kids. You are teaching the little ones. And how about the little ones who are acting Whoa. just like little lambs? Let's do that. You Yay, so little awesome. ones. I could hear you all singing like everything. It's awesome. Thank you. Oh, it's great. Well, that's all for right now. Tribal leaders, let's go ahead and turn to page 57 as you prepare for your uh, trip into Jerusalem. My guess is things are going to be really buzzing in Jerusalem marketplace. As sad as everyone was yesterday, I think they're going to be really, really happy. Now, if someone hasn't heard about Jesus, you can go up to the shopkeepers and say, did you hear? And if they say, what? What did I hear or not hear? You say, Jesus is alive. And then you can tell them the whole story about what happened. And... Um also, be sure to listen for the Shalom Bell like we've been doing every day and let, pa let Jacob, this guy here, dismiss you each by one tribe at a time. And I want you to take note of where you are sitting. Um, Elijah and Shirley, you'll be up in that pew there too with um, the big kids. Cause, um, anybody past Landon, it, it, that's all parents. And that way you guys, you don't have to have chairs or anything. You can come up. Have fun with the songs. I think there's going to be some Hollywood talent scouts oh here, Oh, my too, goodness. So well, I, you know what? You're already famous in the Father's eyes. That's right. Every one of you is a star. But Lammy's pretty happy with that. Yes. So let's say it together. Okay. Shalom. Shalom. Tribe time. Shalom to all our parents and friends. That word means peace be to you. That's what shalom means. The children have been learning that this week. And they've learned that the peace, the real peace that really lasts, comes from Jesus himself. It can only be found in Jesus. Nope. Whoa, Sorry. there we go. We I'm checked. Sorry. Sorry about we that. We checked. You're here. Here. You all should be really proud of your, your children. Um, each one of them is a unique 
and wonderful gift from God. I don't have to tell you that because you already know that. And we are so glad that they were with us this week. We've been looking forward to, and they've been looking forward to having you be here today so they can um, share some of the things they've been doing this week. And these things, you being here, you don't know how much that really means to them. They're so glad to have you. One of their fun friends this week, and maybe you've heard about him, is Lammy. <laughs> Lammy wasn't always a good lamb either. Well, Lammy's playful. He tripped me um, one day. He's kind of a fun, playful little lamb who loved playing hide and seek with the kids. So the kids never knew where Lammy was going was gonna to show up. The children were also made part of a tribe. Uh, a tribe is just basically a family group. They were led by their tribe leaders. So I want to ask our tribe leaders to stand up right now. Tribe leaders, would you please stand up? Don't be shy. Let's give them a hand. Gina. And there's a lot more people behind the scenes. We're going to get coming. to them. We're going to get to them. They were led by their tribe leader and helpers. They traveled through the streets of Jerusalem in an immersive journey. Um, and um, it, it took them through the marketplace of Jerusalem so they could meet its people. Uh, they met different artisans in the marketplace who taught them how to weave, taught them how to make an instrument. I, he has a really interesting question. I think he wants to. Yeah, ask. what's the question? <laughs> oh, don't you get, worry don't about worry it. About all your it things, isn't so going anywhere. Yeah, It'll be there no, when we get either. done. So they made they made jewelry. They did pottery. They learned some woodworking. They even made some baskets. Yeah. They uh, had snacks in a friendly home in Jerusalem, which was a lot of fun. They also spent time with with me, Jacob the shepherd, and my good friend Rachel, who's our song maker. Rachel the song maker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know, Lammy. I know, I know you were here. Yeah, I know. You, and you stay uh, <laughs> each yeah, each day was <laughs> each day was a new adventure, wasn't it, guys? So now we're going to break that down for you into each day what your kids were learning and what they were um, doing and seeing and singing. So day one. So on day one, our memory maker for the day was Jesus is King. Trust Jesus. That's right. Day one was all about Jesus' entry into Jerusalem. Our memory friend was our donkey. Because Jesus rode in on the donkey. Who gave Jesus his sweet ride into <laughs> Jerusalem, right? Low and slow. That's how he went. We learned that Jesus is the king of kings. And their Bible verse of the day was, Jesus Christ is Lord. Philippians 2, 11. And because Jesus is king. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. And the theme song for the day was Jesus, Jesus. So I want you guys to come, come up here. Up. We had a kind of a free form week where everybody just finds their place. And if they want to make circles, they make circles. They are having taller kids, taller kids. Yep. Taller kids back here. I'm going to have you back there. Older kids and you older kids. You have been so wonderful leading. Okay. Everybody grab your, your place. Grab a place. Get ready. I need to hear you sing. Jesus came and lived among us. No, we can live for him. Jesus came and walked among us. No, we can walk with him. Then he gave his life for his sacrifice. Jesus, Jesus, precious Jesus, he died.
a service. Okay, you, you'll get everything. <laughs> Grab a seat again. Go back. Thank you. Sorry. There we go. <laughs> okay, so that was, that was day one. And that was all about how, uh, how Jesus came into Jerusalem. Day two was all about how Jesus showed us God's love by washing his followers' feet and how he continues to do it when we get messy. And what we learned from that story was that when we mess up, Jesus can clean us up. Absolutely. So our memory maker for that day was Jesus showed God's love. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. And our memory friend was who? Honey the honeybee. Honey, honey the honeybee. That's it. Honey, very original names we have here. <laughs> honey the honeybee who reminds us how good and sweet God really is to each and every one of us. And our Bible verse for the day is, you should love each other. John 13 and to 34, verse 34. And, and the theme song of the day is, trying to steal my line. I am, that's it. <laughs> sing to the Lord. So please come up and get ready for sing to the Lord. Same place as that you find a word. Big kids in the back. Taller. Good job, guys. Girls, I want to hear you sing. Here we go. Get ready. Sing to the Lord a new song. Let me hear it. Don't forget to sing. Day three was kind of a, a tough day as some of the dark clouds started rolling in. And the first of those clouds was Jesus's arrest. We learned that even when things get scary, we've got to what? Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. Our memory maker for that day was Jesus loves us. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. And what did we have that day? What was our... We have, we have the dog, and it was a shepherd dog, right? That's Pastor? right. Our memory friend was the, the shepherd dog, and a lot of you remembered is a tough name, an Anatolian shepherd who helps to shepherd the sheep. Makes my job as a shepherd a lot easier because that dog can protect the sheep, fight off predators, and is very gentle and good with the sheep. The shepherd dog also reminds us of how good and gentle Jesus is with us, how he guides us, and how he protects us in our life because we are his flock. And our verse for that day was, nothing will ever be able to separate us from the love of God. And that comes from Romans 8, 39. And the theme song for that day is Power in the Blood. So come on up and show them Power in the Blood. This is one of their favorites. Okay, go on up. Good job. Wow. <laughs> <laughs>
Praises up to the Father. Okay. So we were talking about in day three how the, the clouds were beginning to gather, and then day four, which was yesterday, was really a very sad day. It was about Jesus' death for, for us and for our sins. And we learned that sins do have consequences and that those sins do have to be paid for. But the good news is, is that Jesus died so that we wouldn't have to. Jesus went to the cross for us so we wouldn't have to die like that because God loves us so much. Um, he died for the whole world, not just for some people. He died for everyone. And what, a, what an awesome thing to know that we have that. And, and as sad oh, as our sins make us, you're not you're trying to steal my line. She's just, she wants I, to go I'm those so songs. I know, she's this. just like, I got to get on that song. <laughs> and as, as sad as our sins make us feel, they can also make us glad because we know that God took care of our sins. We've, we've learned that we can be sad and glad at the same time, Rachel. And our memory maker for that day was Jesus died for us. Trust, Trust Jesus. Jesus. And although it was a sad day, there is joy that comes from that, right? And we're going to sing about his great love. So you can take these off and come out. There you go. You don't have to climb under them. Good job. Come on, Weston. Yes. Oh, get ready. It's coming. Find your place. God loves us. God sent His Son to die for us because of His great love.
the kids a hand yay good job guys they're doing a fantastic job huh need some help there rachel all right day five today is all about easter and we learned that jesus rose again from the dead and that he gives us eternal life when we Trust Jesus. Oh, Rachel was sleeping on that, too. And, hey, that's all right. This is the source of real and lasting joy in all of our lives. And our memory maker for that day was, is what? Jesus lives. Trust Jesus. And if you remember, our memory friend was a chick reminding us that God gives each of us a new life when we belong to Jesus. And so this is our one of our final songs, but we have one more song at the very end that's going to involve everybody. So this is the last one for the kids. Kids Group come up and do Happy important. Day, okay? They've just learned this one actually this morning, and I am so proud of them. They picked these songs up really quick. Here, I'll get it, sweetheart. Don't fall. I'm going to set that. There. Thank you. I know. They'll, they'll pick it up. Okay, so follow along in the view of Christ, our great learners who sold with Jesus is alive. Gotta sing it out. Day in history. Death is beaten, you have rescued me. Sing it out, Jesus is alive. Empty cross, the empty grave. Life eternal, you have won the day. Shout it out. Jesus is alive. Don't He's alive. And oh, happy day, happy day. You washed my sin away. Oh, happy day, happy day. I'll never be the is alive. Empty cross, the empty grave. Life eternal, you have won the day. Shout it out, Jesus is alive.
Oh, let's make a little hole for, for Jacob the shepherd. Awesome. Okay, but why don't we sit down? Because I'm just afraid you great. might fall in. You guys in. just stay there. Yeah, just can stay there. stay there and have a seat right in front. Yeah. Well, thank you Good so much for applesauce. bringing your children to our VBS at St. Paul's Lutheran Church. It was an honor. It was a joy uh, and a privilege having your children with us this week. And I really mean that. I'm not just saying that because it says it up there. I'm saying it because we really did. I know all the teachers, all the shopkeepers all said this was really one of our best VBSs. Um, they got to know the kids more one-on-one. -on -one. The kids were so good. All yeah. of them. Maybe they not were, like at home, but they were good they here. They were good so. here. They were good. <laughs> and we want you to know your family's always welcome at St. Paul's. And if you'd ever like to just, you know, chat with me anytime, I'd be happy to do that. Uh, we are very, you know, proactive about families. We support, we want to sub, uh, backstop families in Holtville because we know how hard it is to raise a family today. We know all the pressures that are out there and how challenging that can be. And we want you to know that God is definitely pro-family, and He wants your family to succeed. He really does. He doesn't want you just to succeed, though. He wants you to thrive. Maybe we can help you on that journey. Before we close out, I'd like for all who helped out in, in, the, in front of things and behind the scenes, would you guys all come in? Jake, come on in, Laura. Come on out. We're come on calling out. you. Come on. We're calling you. Lazarus, come, Quick. come forth. Quick, come. Come, come. Jesse, come on. Hey, the don't, kids are quicker than you. Come yeah, on, don't hold back on. or I'll make it even more embarrassing. So, <laughs> yeah. Anybody that's helped them. That's so all of our here. leaders, too, that were here, we have go kids. ahead, stand up. Yes, everybody. All, everybody, all everybody. That's not all of what we had, but this is a lot of our, our, our every and day of the week here. who you were here. So what we want you to do is to, is to thank them and honor them for their service today. Can't do it alone. Well done. Thank you. And it has been such an honor. It's been such an honor to have your kids. And I say this, this is the only legacy. You can leave your children as the legacy of faith. So please, that is the only thing that on this earth that we can leave to our, release to our children is faith. So be sure we do that every day. And um, we just loved having your kids. It was an honor to it really was. be a part of their lives. Today. And we do have CDs of all the fun music that the kids were seeing. Plus, there's other things on there. It's way better than the Baby Shark song. So if you're, <laughs> if you're all funned out on Baby Shark, this might be kind of fun. It's a lot of what you heard today. It is. There. It really is. Uh, these run $10. We also oh, have a sorry. few of our VBS t-shirts that are left over. So if there's someone in your family that would like some and they have, we have the right size, uh, we're, those run at $7. So if your child didn't get one, you can go ahead and, and pick one up. On the, the, yeah, they'll be on yeah. the back table with the CDs. All right, this is what the kids have been looking forward to and all week. Our big surprise. Do we tell them yet or do we make the parents still have to sing? Rachel, they've been so good. Why don't you tell okay. them what it is? Okay, I am going to share the surprise. And I think a lot of them are reading it. But we are doing shaved ice. But we, okay, you all get shaved ice. And it's, we'll explain where to go after the program. But right now, I want you guys stay here. Parents, okay. you are involved on this one. So, so first um, of all, we're going we're gonna to do, uh, do one inch voices. And grandparents. Shh. Okay. And so let's close now with a prayer, and then we'll, we'll finish ourselves up. Every day we have done this with Shalom, and uh, Shalom, again, means peace. And we're going to be singing Shalom Chavarim, which means um, peace to you, my friend. My friend. Yeah, it's, it's more than just a pal. It's somebody that's a real close comrade. So let's put our hands together. You guys all know how to do this. Moms and dads, put your hands. You're never too old to talk close to Jesus, right? Close your eyes, bow our heads, repeat after me. Dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. For this incredible week. For this incredible week. Thank you, Jesus, for dying for us. Thank you, Jesus, for dying for us. And Jesus, thank you. And Jesus, thank you. From coming back from the dead. From coming back from the dead. Lead and guide us in our lives. Lead and guide us in our life. Bless our family and friends. Bless our family and friends. And all God's people said, Amen. Amen. Now, kids, stay here stay because here. we have something special. I'm going to let, so, I'm going to let, uh, okay. 
this is your idea. <laughs> and parents, grandparents, please stand up. Everybody that's here, if you're able, if you have a little baby on your lap, I know it's hard. Um, we're just going to get you involved in the song Shalom today. So the kids are going to be leading it, but it's a very easy. How do you, what do you do with your legs, guys? What do you do? Pick your legs. So you can do this in your pew. Shalom Hadarim, Shalom Hadarim, Shalom, Shalom. Till we meet again, till we meet again, Shalom, Shalom, Shalom Hadarim, Shalom Hadarim, Shalom, Shalom. Shalom, 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 shalom.